that way? Then That's a good question. Um, the answer to that is very, very complex. But I can tell you that RCA, um, telecommunications, has discovered that they can save millions of dollars by understanding these aspects of the planets and how they interfere with the transmission of communication systems on this planet. And they've learned that they hired a guy named Nelson to do the calculations of these planetary movements, knowing that if they could predict atmospheric distorting in energies from these planetary movements, that they could save millions of dollars by rerouting these communication techniques. And that's probably one of the simplest explanations why it works. It works and we know it because it has influences, okay? There's another thing. My dad worked for Sandia Corporation in Albuquerque, New Mexico. It's one of the greatest scientific research centers in the world. That's where they did most of the nuclear stuff, Alamogordo, nuclear bombs, and all that stuff. And my dad had a top secret position there he was working in. And um, um, I happened to get a hold of a publication that Sandia did a research, computer research, on uh, accidents at Sandia Corporation. And they found that people tended to have accidents, accidents when their sun and moon formed the same relationship they did at their birth. And I've got that study, it's quite amazing. And I mean, my dad was always skeptical of astrology, and he used to say, what kind of BS is that? Huh. But when he saw that, he was kind of amazed, because this was astrology at work. So if a person was born with a sun, moon, I'll give a quick of that, I'll show you real quick. Um, i put my marker right here. If you were born, like, with sun, in your case, you have a sun, square, moon. All right? So your, your, your moon is over here squaring your sun by 90 degrees. Right. Okay, so these are an exact square. Now, if you, that means that every month that happens, there's a first or last quarter because they're both squaring, right? In other words, the, the sun moon form a square two times a month, right? When it's so twice going, a month, I'm more prone to an accident. To, more prone to be an accident, I'm prone at those times. Yeah. Um, and, and but I got angels. I get, I get saved. But yeah. why, why accidents? <laughs> well, they just, I'm just saying in their studies, that's what they found. I they found that cold. people tended to have accidents when those things repeated themselves every month. More likely to have an accident than oh. they were, but they're more likely to than any other time of month. Only when it's a square? Or no, no, no. Whatever aspect conflict. you're born, if you're born with a sun moon conjunction. Oh, it has to be the same aspect. It'd be the same thing, right? Um, you know, so mine was, uh, let's say, 150 degrees between my side. Twice a month, that's, that angle come up in my, uh, my chart, too. The point is that. The scientific, there's a book called, uh, by Good Average, it's called, uh, it's an old book, but it's a good one. It's called The Scientific Basis of Astrology, if you're interested in understanding that. There's another book out called Cosmic Clocks by Michael Gokalin, and he set about to disprove astrology. He worked for the Sorbonne, and he was a uh, researcher at the Sorbonne in France. His life was totally shaken up because he set about to disprove astrology, and he ended up writing books to prove it. That always happens. Yeah, so let's take a break and have some pizza. So, okay. Are you ready? Yeah. I know it's dropping.